right there, I'm gonna be higher than a Georgia pine. Leaving Myrtle Beach, I was really excited about my trip. Tuesday morning, just outside of Atlanta, and those fucking pumps broke down. Jackson, Mississippi, day two. I still got a ways to go. I'm hoping things will go better today, especially after the bus breaking down yesterday. That was just total BS. And we left someone at the station. We were on our way back to go pick them up when the damn bus broke down. But they're servicing our bus right now, and hopefully we'll get on your way. We're back on the bus, getting ready to start day two of travel. If I hadn't had a four hour layover in Dallas, our breakdown outside of Atlanta would have caused me to miss my bus. The longer I sat on the bus, the more anxious I was to get to Colorado. If there hadn't been so much drama from the stretch to Atlanta to Dallas, I probably could have enjoyed the ride. My trip out was so bad that I felt the Greyhounds change their slogan from leave the driving to us to we'll ruin your trip for you. However, the return trip home was great with no drama and everybody on the bus was pretty cool. New River. The only real difference was the routes that we took. My trip out was the southern route and my trip back was the northern route. Seems to me that the Greyhound staff at the bus station, as well as the drivers on the southern route, were rude and inconsiderate. They also seemed to go out of their way to make examples of people that they felt were stupid.
stark contrast, the drivers on the northern route seem to be very helpful. They also seem to be very considerate, same as the staff that man the bus station. So in the end, my bus riding experience was a C, C minus, C plus, however you want to look at it. And in the end, you're still on a bus. Riding on a bus for days is difficult and stressful for anyone. If it wasn't stressful and you got there faster, everybody would be riding the bus. But what an adventure. I met a lot of interesting people and I had a lot of great conversations. But that's not for everyone. It takes a certain kind of person to enjoy a bus ride, I would imagine. So what do I think about Greyhound slogan now? I think leave the driving to us is about right. It's a tough job, and it's a lot of responsibility. And it is nice to let someone else drive for a change. Good morning, Atlanta. Pulling out of Atlanta at 7 in the morning, realizing I had less than 10 hours to go, I was excited that this adventure was almost over. Just like this video.